In part two of this video series about search algorithms, we will take a look at binary search algorithm. Binary search algorithm searches an ordered list to find the value you are searching for, starting at the middle of the list and comparing that with the value you are searching for, which is also called a search term. Note here that binary search requires the list to be sorted, which is different to the linear search, which does not require the list to be sorted. Let's look at binary search algorithm. The steps in the binary search algorithm for the list sorted in ascending order are as follows. Start at the middle of the list. Divide the list in two halves and compare the value of the middle item with the value you are searching for. If they match, then stop. If they don't match, then if the value you are searching for, that is, the search term is smaller than the value of the middle item, then discard middle item, and everything on the right side of it. And if the search term is bigger than the value of the middle item, then discard middle item and everything on the left side of it. Algorithm does this as we know that the list is sorted in ascending order and if the search term is smaller than the value of the middle item, that means you need to search amongst the list of items on the left side of the middle item as everything on the right side will be bigger than the search term. Similarly, if the search term is bigger than the value of the middle item, that means you need to search amongst the list of items on the right side of the middle item, as everything on the left side will be smaller than the search term. Now you are left with a list of items on the left or right side of the middle item. Repeat the above steps on the part of the list that was not discarded, that is, starting at the middle of this list and comparing the value of the middle item with the search term and discarding items on the left or right side of the middle item. Keep doing this until you've found a match for the search term or there are no more items in the list to search. Let's take an example and apply the steps in the binary search algorithm. Imagine you have been given sorted list of numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7 and 9 that you can see on your screen and you need to search for number 9 in that list. Now let's work through the steps in the algorithm. Compare the middle item in the list 4 with 9, which is the value we are, we are searching for, or in other words, search term. Since 4 and 9 do not match, and 9 is bigger than 4, so we discard 4 as well as everything that is on the left side is 4. Our new list now is 5, 7 and 9. Compare the middle item in the list 7 with 9, which is the search term. Since 7 and 9 do not match, and 9 is bigger than 7, so we discard 7, as well as everything that is on the left side of 7. Our new list now only has one item, which is 9. So compare 9 with the search term, which is also 9. Since they match, we have found our item in the list. Report that the item is found and exit the algorithm. If we were to search for 8, which is not in the list, then we will not find the item in the list and will have to report item not found and then exit the algorithm. Let's compare linear search with binary search. Suppose we have sorted list of 1000 items. Then for linear search, the best case is when the value you are searching for is the first item in the list. Here, you require only one comparison. The worst case is when the value you are searching for is the last item in the list. Here, you will need 1000 comparisons as algorithm will have to compare every single item in the list till it finds the match in the 1000th comparison. For a very long list, this could take a long lot of time. Binary search in contrast is much faster than linear search as each time you compare the value and when there is no match you discard half the list. For binary search, 
the best case would be for the value you are searching for to be in the middle item in the list. Here, you require only one comparison. The worst case scenario is when the value you are searching for is the last possible division.